Today, I wanna share with you what the glymphatic system is and why it regulates your perception and the quality of life and what you can do to make sure it's optimal. In the next three minutes, I'm going to share with you seven ways to detoxify your brain. In 2012, researchers discovered and named a whole new system in the body. It's called the glymphatic system. Now, I didn't hear about this until I started researching this for you, so bear with me here. Your glymphatic system has a really fascinating job to do. It uses the mitochondria to remove the cellular waste from the brain. It's kind of like your brain's personal lymphatic system and that it drains out toxins in your brain. But instead of just draining these toxins through the kidneys and livers, it uses your cerebrospinal fluid. Scientists have found that your lymphatic system is the most active, in fact, 60% more active, you guessed it, while you're asleep. Now, what do we do with all this? Well, at FitLife, we believe in providing you with a plan that can actually help you along the way. So I wanna show you seven ways you can support your glymphatic system so that you can improve your sleep, you can wake up with more energy, you can detox your brain, and you can enhance the quality of your life. Are you ready? Numero uno, cranial sacral therapy. And what it does is it's gentle hands-on therapy that promotes the release of past trauma and toxic buildup in the fluid surrounding the brain and the spinal cord and that's the motion that aids in the glymphatic system of flushing it out. And it resets those neurochemicals in your brain like that. So it's a really cool therapy to try. Number two, intermittent fasting. I love it, it works for me. It doesn't work for everybody, right? It may not work for you, but intermittent fasting improves the mitochondrial function and you start to feel this right away. How will you notice it? Well, more energy will start to show up you'll literally start to feel like your brain's on fire, maybe the first time in a very, very long time. The next one is movement. Now the writing is on the wall, right? One of the best things that you can do is to actually move your body to keep your brain young. It's this uh, fit life lifestyle, we call it. Moving, going outside, connecting to nature, that is a real help for your lymphatic system. Sleeping on your side. Studies have shown that the lymphatic system seems to work the most effectively when you are lying on your side instead of your back or your stomach. There's also pranayama yoga, which is learning to breathe properly. <sighs> Breathing with your hara, in Japanese it's called. And when you do this, you actually lower your cortisol levels, which is the stress that we talk about, right? Organifi, ashwagandha, lowers your stress. Breathing deeply lowers your stress, and it can have beneficial effects on your nervous system and the cerebral spinal fluid that we talked about. Massage and chiropractic care is amazing for this as well. It's good for your lymphatic, overall body. It's probably good for your glymphatic as well. We are constantly learning new things about how our brains work. Our brains are literally the most complex systems on the planet, and they are central to our health and our development as we age. I want you to make your brain a priority. So I want you to make sure you're getting enough sleep. Getting enough sleep isn't just about feeling good the next day. It may have an influence on your health, your mental stamina in the years to come. Consider every single night you go to bed an investment in your overall health. What if sleep was a doctor that you saw, you checked in every single night, and sleep the doctor made sure that you were healthy? That's the way we need to look at it, right? Invest in your health now or pay for your sickness later, my friend. Make sure you're subscribing to our YouTube channel. You can join me on Snapchat for daily inspiration and see kind of what we're doing behind the scenes and also add me on Facebook. I'm Drew Canoli. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. As always, remember, we're in this together. I'll talk to you soon.